Hi. No worries, I'll just sit over there. Get the hint when I'm not wanted. Sorry, sorry, I was miles away. Um, you're supposed to be on holiday, you're not at work, are you? Yeah, uh, which is why I think it's okay to treat myself to a coffee. But I'll, I'll leave you in peace if you'd like. No, sorry, I didn't mean it to sound that bad. Come and sit down, it's fine. Sit down. You all right? Yeah, not really. <laughs> Pete and I had a bit of a clash before. Been quite good at clashes recently, oh, you two. How bad is it that people just expect it from us? Look, if it's getting you this down, don't you think you should let him know how you feel? I think he's sick of hearing it. Maybe I should change the record, you know? People have got far worse things they're dealing with, haven't they? That doesn't mean your worries don't count. I know, but I just want things to feel fun again. Maybe we should just have a laugh, a bit of romance, you know? Nah, that's overrated. Are you and Andrea OK? What do you think? OK. Well, now it's my turn to repay your good deed of dragging it out of me by doing the same, so come on. I found out something about when me and Andrew first met, and... now I'm not sure that I can trust her anymore. Well, what's she done? Her making a play for me was basically a setup. so... How do you mean? Well, Mum told Graham to keep check on me, and he paid Andrea to do it instead. Oh, my God, that's terrible. Yeah. You won't say anything, will you? Of course not. She's trying to say she regrets it because she ended up falling for me, but I'm not having it. I mean, if she was lying at the start, how do I know any of it was real? Jamie, I'm so sorry. Yeah, me too. She's got no idea how much it hurts, you know? How am I supposed to carry on as if nothing's happened? Nothing like a random lunchtime perspective check, is there? <laughs> Thanks for listening. Just about to say the same to you. Any time, by the way. Thanks. See you later. See you.